this is John Constantine. If you feel you've reached this message in error, then sod off, you lucky bastard. The rest of you, don't leave a number. Unlock the door. Cheers! Hey guys, it's me, and I'm back for another YouTube video, and, uh... Yes, I'm dressed really formally right now, um, because I am doing my first cosplay video with you guys. Um, this video, uh, this series I'm starting is uh, going to teach you guys how to cosplay on a budget and how I do it personally. So um, let's get started. So the char character I'm helping you cosplay today is the infamous John Constantine, the Hellblazer himself. Um, my favourite DC character, personally. Um, so yeah, to start off, well, costume-wise, you're going to need a long sleeve white shirt, which you're most likely already wearing for school, a red tie, I got mine from a charity shop, and the famous tan trench coat, which I also got from a charity shop. And also, um, if you don't smoke, um, make your own cigarette. This is made of paper, tape, and that's eyeshadow pattern on them. But yeah, so um, first step is the makeup. There's not much makeup to do for my version of John, but um, I'll show you guys how I do that. <laughs> So that's all I really do for John Constantine's makeup is a little bit like pink under the eyes um, and then to make it look like I've got eyes. So this is more of like, I always go for like the um, Pazuzu. If you've watched uh, Constantine, you know what I'm on about. Like he invites a demon into his body and he goes like really feral and he like gains like that under his eyes and stuff. Um, yeah, the products I used, literally I just used like five colors from this palette and like a cheap some cheap makeup brushes um i haven't gotten into my morphe palette yet yeah guys um but yeah that's it for makeup now i'm gonna get get into the rest of the costume so that is it um really to cosplay constantine don't need much um i'm wearing on the bottoms of just wearing trousers. He typically has his shirt untucked. He's quite a scruffy man. So like, if I can move far back enough. See, it's like completely untucked. Um, Cause he's quite scruffy. I don't have a wig. Now you don't need to have a wig to cosplay Constantine. I mean, if you're like blonde, you've already got a stars for it. Um, but, you know, as long as you look like it, like, you don't have to have everything. Like, cosplaying on a budget is important. The tie's a little bit too long. Um, you know, cosplaying isn't about looking exactly like the character. Like, you know, have some fun with it. I mean, I love Constantine so much. Like, he's so good. I mean, <laughs> he's my favourite DC character. If you don't know who he is, um, you s I don't think there's any way you can really like watch Constantine anymore um, but you can watch him on uh, DC Legends of Tomorrow uh, he's on that um, and he's been on an episode of Arrow I think yeah he's been he was in season 4 episode 5 Haunted um, that's a good episode it's the only episode of Arrow I've ever watched sorry if I sound ill I've got a cold um, but yeah so personally i don't have a wig for it i mean when i had uh, my bleached highlights it you know it made it look better because my hair was lighter especially if i do it in the summer my hair does go a little bit lighter but if you watch the original show his hair's slightly more brown than it is in dc legends of tomorrow because uh, that was like freshly bleached whereas like in the sh normal constantine show it's a little bit different and at the end of the day as well it's your own interpretation of the character you don't have to follow everything i said but like yeah um so yeah that's it it's i mean it's quite a short video anyway um i'll insert a tiktok of um what the cosplay looks like in action i guess um <laughs>
add something to like the cosplay you can draw a star on the palm of your hand like that um, you can draw like his tattoo I mean if you want to be like really prestigious you can draw his tattoos on your arm but you're not really gonna see them because he wears long sleeve shirts I mean he does roll his sleeves up but I have them down um, I mean you wouldn't see them if you're wearing the coat anyway so I mean it's up to you if you're up for like doing that extra subtle detail that not many people would see um, again like small makeup you know if you want to make it like I don't put any like primer or concealer on I want it to make it look a little bit more natural I mean you can if you're more comfortable with doing like beardy stuff I guess you can do his five o'clock shadow but there's not really much you can do with Constantine makeup wise if you want to make him look battered and bruised I mean you can do that too um but that's it for this video if you guys liked it thank you so much for watching um if you guys liked it don't forget to hit that that like button smash the like button and don't forget to comment down below who's your favorite dc character um mine's constantine duh um he's been my favorite for a while now and i love him so much he's brilliant and he's he's a bisexual icon i stand um that's something you can add to it actually i just thought of that so if you want to add something extra to the cosplay um like for example there are people who cosplay at like pride events um if you're cos if you want to cosplay him at a pride event because he is bisexual um excuse me this could be an accessory that you have casually on him just like underneath i'm just trying to think how you would style the flag with the and like pin it maybe i don't know that could work and you like yeah like <laughs> Constantine what are you doing bye <laughs> oh, I'm sorry about that um yeah I hope you guys enjoy thank you so much for watching sorry there wasn't a video last week by the way um I was so busy with everything um just work got in the way and it was my last week of mock so I was focusing on those especially physics because I suck at science so anyway thank you guys so much for watching this video don't forget if if you want to see more content like this and you want to you know if you want to hit that subscribe button down below and hit the notification bell next to it to be subscribed every time i upload a new video thank you guys so much for watching i love you guys and i'll see you next monday bye hello you reach sean constantine's demon and more if this is a true demonic emergency and you're in immediate mortal peril you've called the right number Unfortunately, we've stepped away from the phone, so you'll have to leave a message. And remember, our merch shop is now open, so get your official John Constantine's Demon Defeaters t-shirts with original artwork by Gary Street. Also, do you ever still prank calling us and muttering infernal curses? It's scary. It's going to make you wet my bed, so it's going to stop. Uh-oh. Why do we have all these boxes of t-shirts? You take my credit card again. I've got to go. Leave a message. <laughs> <laughs>